fin uh, just finished day uh, day eight, and you know every day just coming out here, just making sure we're getting better, just fundamentally. And, and it's a little slow today, maybe because we had two yesterday, but still, there's no reason for us to go. We cannot. We're not good enough where we, we miss a day. And we, each day have to count for us. We're not a good football team. So each day is about getting better. And guys have to understand that you can't come out here and take a day off. It's not about taking days off. It's about each day putting it in. And you know they have to understand that it's going to be hard. And we know that. But we're trying to get enough rest, get enough food in the where at night they need to go to bed so they can come out and compete on the, on the days that we do practice. Charlie, was it more of an effort thing that, that, that you wanted to see from them? No, it's just a, a little sluggish, and uh, guys, you, know, you got to wake up and just go to work, and just make sure that we just don't punch that clock. Charlie, can you give us an update on Michael Lee Harris? Knee? Well, Michael Lee it was his left knee, and it is an ACL, so uh, as, as to what, what the extent of it is, and uh, he understand, he knows it, so uh, he's just right now. Um, we're just gonna take our time with him, and then. Uh, uh, he, he just knows it. You know, just making sure that we want to make sure that he's okay. What is Charlie? he like just mentally? I mean, you know, this is his fourth time he's had a knee injury, and, you know, it seemed like he was making so much progress coming back. Well, when you make progress and then you go down, then you're not, you're not just mentally. That's what it is. It's just a toll on you because you put so much into it. Have you ever seen a guy that, that has had this many, uh, you know, knee issues and then uh, come back and, and, and be as good as he he was before all the injuries. Have you seen situations like that? No, I've never been around it where he had the, had the knee injuries and then they put him As his coach, Charlie, to watch a kid go through that, I mean, is it heartbreaking for, for you guys as well to, to, to see those struggles? Well, he has, he provides so much energy to the team, and you want everything to work out for him. And, and to watch any player go down, it just it's not a good feeling for any coach because they put so much work into it, and then all of a sudden, you know, you get out there and practice, and it didn't even happen in a game, just a practice situation where it happened, and there's a plant, and then uh, he goes down, and you just don't want to see that happen to any player. Are there any other in injuries uh, from camp so far? I saw Tyon Dixon uh, had surgery as well. Yeah, Tyon uh, ended up injuring his foot, and uh, so uh, he ended up having surgery. Otherwise, it's pretty injury-free camp. Oh, that's been fine. Yeah, other notes too. Is that a season-ending deal for Tyon as well? Oh, I don't, uh, I don't know that. Uh, we just had surgery the other day, so uh, just as soon as we can get him back out here. Thanks, coach. Thanks, coach.